Hey and welcome to the Gwembassy. I'm Gwem. Do you like my top? It is a continental uh, cycling top. I'm kind of wearing it so people will think that I'm a bit sporty. So let me know if you think I've pulled that off in the comments. I've been doing these shootout videos, right? I compared the Roland T8 against the originals and I've been comparing 303 clones against my original 303. But one of the things I've always wondered is what is the effect of component aging? Let's say we took two drum machines straight from the factory we would assume they sound nearly identical, right? But after 40 years of aging, of being put in the back of tour vans, of being in different studios, of being bought and sold on eBay, maybe stored in the loft or the garage, they will be subjected to different environments and they're gonna end up sounding different, or so we are told. What really is the effect of component aging though? That is what I'm attempting to find out in this video. So I have got two Roland TR606 drum machines here. I've programmed the same beat into both and we are going to compare them and we'll see what the results are. So I've got both of the TR606s synced to each other. The sync master is this one here in the case and this one is the sync slave. I'm going to start by playing the complete drum beat on each machine in turn. We'll start with the case one. I'll try and remember to point at each machine so that you can see which one's playing. They sound really quite different, but they still kind of have the same character though, don't they? I mean, you can tell each one is a 606. What I'll do now is to go through each of the individual sounds. Well, for me at least, that was absolutely fascinating. They both sounded really different. Some sounds more than others for sure, but every sound did sound different. I would say the machine on the left, the, the one without the case, sounded a little bit warmer and the one on the case in the right sounded a little bit sharper. I'm not sure which one I prefer, maybe the sharper sound of the one in the case, but it's pretty subjective. Anyway, it's very clear that both machines do sound different, although they both sound like a 606. Component aging does have an effect, and we can't be too anal about 
comparing reissues against originals or clones against originals because the originals don't sound like each other either. I always say if it sounds good, it is good. And I hope you'll take that on board. Thanks a lot for watching and I hope to see you in another video soon. Take care.